says that multiple law enforcement agencies are still looking for those two suspects who ran into the woods after we're told a police chase and crash near County Line Road near the interstate. Right here behind me, you can see evidence um, of that police chase and crash tire marks leading into this tree here. And this is where uh, police say those two armed suspects then got out of the car and it took off eastbound uh, down Wakefield Court. Again, you can see evidence of those tire marks here. Now, during the initial stages of the manhunt, police placed the village of Bayside on a lockdown. And there was also a Facebook message that was posted. But by late morning, uh, that lockdown was lifted with police assuring residents, even without an arrest, the area is now safe. There was a very extensive search by multiple agencies, including Milwaukee County Sheriff's Department, Milwaukee Police Department, and our partners on the North Shore agencies throughout yards and the ravines and everything. Um, we're extremely confident that they are no longer in the area. There's dog parks and pathways and, you know, it's very wooded everywhere that you go in this area, but the ravine is, is key. So there's a lot of places to hide, essentially. I would say. Now we have been told that that chase was actually initiated by a DEA drug enforcement team, not by Bayside Police, but Bayside Police along with Milwaukee uh, City and County were called out here to help with that search as well. But again, we have not been told why exactly that chase was initiated, nor why police believe those suspects are armed and dangerous. But again, no arrests have been made, but those two suspects are still on the run.